the Joe Rogan experience. Yeah, did you like any of the early Lego Star Wars sets? I know some people like to make fun of how these sets have aged, but I actually prefer this older era of Lego Star Wars over the modern shit. Oh, hell yeah, I did like that older shit. Yeah, I like how simple they were, how they were typically sold at a lower price point um, compared to today, and that the parts palette was a bit more colorful and basic. And I loved how you could make some dope alternate builds as well. I totally get what you're saying, Joseph. You yearn for simpler times where Lego Star Wars was the hot new thing. When it came out in 1999, it was one of the most successful product launches in Lego's history. It totally transformed how Lego approached partnerships with other licenses, especially with movie licenses. Yeah, I remember when these sets first came out, they actually intrigued me, even though I was well in my 30s at the time. This shit was extremely cool. Same. I actually bought a couple of these sets when they originally came out, and they kind of got me started in collecting Lego. Word, they had that effect on me as well. 1999 was a great year for Lego. So how many Star Wars sets came out during that year? In 1999, there were 13 LEGO Star Wars sets in total. One of the smallest sets of this wave was set 7101 Lightsaber Duel. Oh yeah, I remember this one. I never really seen episode one, so I don't really know who these guys are though. To me, it looks like Jesus Christ is having an epic lightsaber sword fight with the devil, uh, which is fucking badass. Dude, now that you mention it, I totally see that as well. Those minifigs are actually Qingong Jin and Darth Maul, but you could totally use Qing Jong's head and torso to create the most perfect Jesus minifigure. Oh, dude, that's perfect. He looks very much like Christ. What are the what are the side builds in this set? I see that Darth Satan has a flying mobility scooter, whilst Christ is fighting on the ground. Also, what's that fence thingy back there? That thing back there is a moisture evaporator. It's a little uh, piece of scenery to represent the planet of Tatooine. It really helps to build up the atmosphere of Tatooine by having a crucial element of the planet's infrastructure included in this little scenario. You feel me? Ch I feel you, homie. I like its inclusion in the set, and you could use those pieces to build an alt build on the back of the box as well. It appears to be some type of Christian aircraft. Word. For a small set like this, I appreciate that they tried making uh, something else with the pieces. It's kind of lame, but it still makes a decent parts pack. Um, I like them little ladders and antenna pieces. Shit could be useful for other builds. Yep. For a set this size, it's aight. 